Welcome to our countdown of the top 10 most active volcanoes in Africa. Join Wonderlust Wonders as we embark on a thrilling journey to explore these geological marvels. Our journey begins in the Democratic Republic of Congo, home to Mount Nirogongo. This imposing stratovolcano is a sight to behold, its slopes rising dramatically from the surrounding plains. A vast, churning lake of lava, one of the largest in the world, illuminates the night sky with an eerie red glow. The 2002 eruption saw lava flows reaching the city of Goma in a matter of hours. The constant activity of Nirogongo provides valuable insights for volcanologists studying the inner workings of our planet. Our next stop takes us to another formidable volcano in the Virunga Mountains, Mount Niamuragira. It is considered the most active volcano in Africa, having erupted over 40 times since the late 19th century. Unlike Niragongo's lava lake, Niamuragira erupts with massive lava flows that reshape the surrounding landscape. We now venture into one of the most extreme environments on Earth, the Danakil Depression in Ethiopia, home to the fiery spectacle of Erta Ale. Erta Ale, meaning smoking mountain in the local Afar language, is distinguished by its persistent lava lake, active for over a century. The Danakil Depression itself is a geological marvel, where three tectonic plates meet, creating a landscape of volcanic wonders. Our journey takes us south to Tanzania, where we encounter Oldoinyo Lengai, meaning Mountain of God in the Maasai language. What sets this volcano apart is its unique natrocarbonatite lava, a silvery gray substance that flows almost like water. This unusual lava solidifies quickly upon contact with the air, creating a landscape that appears almost otherworldly. The eruptions of Oldoinyo Lengai, though less frequent, are a sight to behold. The silver lava creates a stark contrast against the dark volcanic rock, showcasing the diversity of volcanic activity on our planet. Our volcanic expedition now takes us across the Indian Ocean to the island of Réunion, where we encounter Piton de la Fournaise. Piton de la Fournaise is one of the most active volcanoes on Earth, erupting frequently, often multiple times a year. Despite its frequent activity, its eruptions are generally effusive, allowing scientists to study the eruptions up close. We journey back to mainland Africa to the western coast where the imposing silhouette of Mount Cameroon dominates the horizon. Standing as the highest peak in West Africa, Mount Cameroon is a stratovolcano that has left an indelible mark on the region's history and geography. Its eruptions, though less frequent, are often explosive, sending plumes of ash and gas high into the atmosphere. The 1999 eruption blanketed nearby villages in ash and disrupted air travel in the region. We return to the Afar Triangle in Ethiopia, a region where the Earth's crust is literally pulling apart to encounter Dabahu Volcano. This remote landscape witnessed a dramatic event in 2005 when Dabahu erupted sending fissures across the desert floor. The eruption marked the birth of a new rift in the Earth's surface. The Afar Triangle is a hotbed of geological activity, where tectonic plates are slowly pulling away from each other. Our exploration of the Afar Triangle continues with Alu Dalafia, another volcanic complex in this geologically active region. In 2008, Alu Dalafila erupted, spewing lava fountains high into the air. The Afar Triangle serves as a natural laboratory for scientists studying plate tectonics and volcanism. Our journey through Africa's most active volcanoes takes us back to the Danakil Depression, this time to Mount Gada Ale. Gada Ale is known for its explosive eruptions, which send plumes of ash and gas high into the atmosphere. The sheer power and beauty of Gada Ale continue to draw scientists and adventurers alike. Our final destination takes us to Eritrea, where we encounter Nabro Volcano, a stratovolcano that made headlines in 2011 with a powerful and unexpected eruption. The eruption blanketed the surrounding landscape in ash and disrupted air travel. The event prompted a surge in scientific research to understand the volcano's history and potential for future eruptions. 
Thank you for joining us on this journey through Africa's most active volcanoes. These fiery giants, while posing significant risks, also play a crucial role in shaping our planet. By appreciating their power and respecting their potential, we can coexist with these forces of nature. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more fascinating insights into our planet's natural wonders.